If you don't have parchment paper, that's okay. You could just spray your your pan with um, the cooking spray. But this just makes cleanup a lot easier. Um, sometimes it's really rolly. No, we don't need that yet. We we'll need that at the end. Okay, so we'll set that aside. So our pan is lined. And what's our next step? P and P and K I and BDC top and contact D and my paper topping. Okay, so I'm also gonna trim this real quick. The K I and C E. So Kale's getting the tortillas. And again. And so Okay, let's get a tortilla first. Okay. So each mummy needs two tortillas. Tortillas. So, they were left over from something else we made uh, on our Fridays at four, and this is, I think, our 23rd show. So, we've been doing this since May. Um, it's been a lot of fun. We had a couple weeks where we took off because we were traveling, but um, other than that, we've been going strong since May, and uh, Gail's having fun here. Let me. Gail's having a hard time on this. Oh, there you go. You're almost there. All right, so you need to get two out. Okay. So we're going to put one on there. You're going to place your first tor tortilla on there. You can put two. One for me and one for you. Okay, so put the rest right here for now. Okay, and then what's our next one? Yep, because we're going to make some more. All right, what does it say? Thomas Ray O C and my baby Tucker. Okay, so we're gonna take our cheese and like I said, you don't have to use just cheddar. But I think Daddy wants cheddar on his, so we're gonna make he likes lots of cheese. I think I think this one. I think we all mm. like lots of cheese in our family. Raise your hand if you like lots of cheese. Hey Carla, thanks for joining us. If anybody has any questions. We are making yummy mummy quesadillas yep. um, today. This is a free recipe from Radish Kids. And um, a lot, talking about Radish Kids, if, if you are interested in having your kids or your grandkids um, starting to learn how to help out in the kitchen, maybe learning how to cook, um, you can use code Caleb, C-A-L-E-B, and get some money off for a six or I think we got plenty of, okay, that's perfect, for a six or 12 month subscription. So um, when you go to checkout, you can use code Caleb and hopefully that will save you some money. All right, so we got, yeah, Caleb has a new apron today too. Yep. He outgrew his little blue one, so we got a, a big kid apron today. All right, so, and our favorite topping. So what's your favorite topping? Salsa. Okay, you get a spoon. Okay, I bet this one, Mom. You mean Mom? You mean it be this one? So those are peppers, so we're gonna have to cut those up. <clears throat> so if you want a pepper, put it on here. You want to cut it up. That salsa. Scoop that out. Not a whole lot. Which one are you gonna do? I'm gonna try and chop. Are we gonna do it on this side? Yeah. Alright, so Caleb is scooping some salsa, and Mom, in the meantime, yep. is going to be putting some. That's plenty, so I'm going to spread it around with your spoon. There you go. Okay, take your spoon and spread it around. There you go. Perfect. That's good. Keep the cheese on there. <coughs> okay, move that around. Spread that around. Alright, so Mom's going to take some. I'm going to put a little bit more salsa. There you go. And spread it around. Oh, okay, right there. Yeah, perfect. All right, now spread it with your spoon, just like that, gently. You gotta do it gently so you don't move all the cheese all around. Got it? Perfect. Okay, yeah, just leave those in there. All right, so we have our cheese and we have our salsa. Yep, I have the peppers. My God, we have peppers. Kale's gonna cut up some. <laughs> These are roasted red peppers. Yeah, the big one. They are big, so we're gonna cut them. You can use the pizza cutter too if you want. Oh, a burnt. Yeah, that's burnt right there. That's because the, it's roasting. So just cut them out into little strips like this. <coughs> Caleb, little strip. 
halfway through. Okay. All right. So this is just um, chicken from Publix that we've cut into strips. You can use, you know, already packaged, sliced, diced, whatever. Um, chicken. But Daddy wanted chicken on his. Do you want chicken on yours, Caleb? Yeah. Okay. okay. No, no, no. One is good. Put a whole lot of pepper there. So you want to start putting some pepper on yours? Yeah. Okay. And you can use a pizza cutter too if you want to slice your peppers. This is not a, a very labor intensive recipe, but we thought it would be something fun since it's coming up on Halloween. Hard to believe. I think it's three weeks, three weeks away. So that's a lot. Of fun. Spread some out. Spread the share the wealth. All right. Uh, did you want chicken on yours? Oh yeah, I like chicken. Okay. You want to put some on? Sure. I okay. Do. All right. See, just like mom did over here. Oh, nice. You don't want to put a whole lot. And then the fun part is we're going to take our. And hurry up, put that on, because then we got to do our other, um, our other tortilla. This yeah. is the mummy part. And this is where you're going to take your pizza cutter and you're just going to slice. Oh, yeah. Nice. I like it. Okay, that's funny. That's funny. Okay. That's a lot of chicken. Okay. Okay, come over here. So you're going to take your pizza cutter and you're just going to slice it. Take a knife one. Or you could use a knife. Do you want to use a pizza cutter and I'll use a knife? I do a knife. Okay. Slice it in little like quarter inch strips, half inch, whatever you think looks like mummy strips. I posted a picture on Caleb's page yesterday of how it's supposed to look at the end. And so you can look at that for reference if you're going to make these um, later. But then you're just going to lay these on top, crisscross, kind of like mummy bandages. Put on as many as you want. Nice. I think mom's going to put on that many. So it looks like a mummy, kind of. Yeah. And then the thing that really makes it look like a mummy is the black olives. So you just want to slice black olives. And you just need two. How are you coming? Looks good, but oh, you need to cut that. There you go. Okay, so you just need two. Oops, I'm showing there's an onion. Daddy got it. All right, come do your mummy eyes. All right, so mom's mummy eyes oh, are mom. done. Oh, you gotta put oh, it on there. Man. That's all right. Looks good. You got the eye. There you go. Put that right in the middle. Want to do your mummy eyes? <laughs> Get two olives out of there. Just two. Pick them up. Yep. Yeah, that's kind of. Nope, just two. You pick them up with your fingers. Pick up. Oh, they good? One. Two. Don't put them on top like that. Two. Like that. Two eyes. All right, so two eyes. Your so nose. We have two mummies. Nope, that's just it. Right there. All right, so we can have that. And then the last. Um, part is what? You want to read that? Step yeah. number five. By play, tell my tail, you chew the deep play, and chew the cake until it cheese comes in. Okay, so you're going to spray the top with cooking spray. Not a whole lot. Here, let me do one, and then you can do the other. Okay. So this just kind of holds it all together, okay. so just like that in a circle. Together in the oven, and so we're gonna bake these. I hope everybody can see them. I don't want to lift it up too much, but uh, it's really cute. It's gonna be a fun dessert. I mean, a fun dinner. Yeah. And so yeah, Caleb's gonna pop these in. But it's your day. We're gonna pop these in the oven. Come here. I hope everybody can see those. 
you need the, okay? So Caleb, come here. I'm going to pop him in the oven. Hey, hey. Nice job. Toys die. Dad's going to, Dad's going to see his, his mummy. Quesadilla. Okay, look, Dad. Come on. All right, look. Because we're going to put him in All the right. oven. Isn't that fabulous? Very cute. Looks good. All right. What do you say when you open the oven, Caleb? Um, hot and a man. Hot oven open. Yeah, yeah. And that is another thing he learned from Radish Kids. He did a Radish Kids camp over the summer and uh, online, of course. Um, but it was a lot of fun. So look for that next year because I think they offer them um, during the summer. But just to let everybody else in the kitchen know that you're going to open the oven, uh, he learned how to say hot oven opening. And then mom says, yeah, chef. It was very uh, quick and easy today, but we wanted to share a fun recipe and encourage you to go visit, visit our friends at Radish Kids. And again, use code uh, Caleb if you want some money off on your subscription. That was, could be a fun Christmas present. I'm on me. Yeah, yep. So, um, Thank you. What do you say? Um, we hope you had a good day with you this week for our fun. All right, we hope you had fun. We'll see you next week. And uh, take care. If you have a fun recipe for us to make, send it in. Bye. Bye, goodbye.